Today we will be replacing the charge port on an iPhone 6 Plus. Be sure to use the works repair mat to keep all screws organized. Some screws have the same size but different lengths and can be easily misidentified during reassembly. Remove two screws from the battery bracket. Use the tip of a plastic spudger to disconnect the battery flex cable. Now using the flat end of the plastic spudger, disconnect the charge port flex cable. Two Phillips screws securing the vibrator to the rear case. Use the flat end of a plastic spudger to disconnect the antenna cable from its socket on the logic board. Remove the vibrator from the iPhone. Remove the Phillips screws securing the speaker. In your fingers, remove the loudspeaker from the device. Remove all of the remaining screws securing the charge port to the rear case. Now remove the lightning port retaining bracket. The flat end of a spudger to begin peeling the lightning connector assembly up from the rear case.
Use the flat end of the smudger to push the microphone out of its recess in the rear case. Carefully pull the lightning connector assembly up slightly to free it from the rear case. Now remove the charge port from the device. Insert the charge port and line up all components and flex cables back to its previous recess place. Insert two Phillips screws to secure the headphone jack to the rear case. Place the microphone brace and Phillips screws to secure it to the rear case. Insert the remaining screws to secure the charge port. Insert the lightning port retaining bracket and use the Phillips screws to secure the bracket to the rear case. Place the loudspeaker back into the device, making sure the antenna cable is on top of the speaker. Insert three Phillips screws to the bottom of the loudspeaker, securing it to the device. Insert the vibrator and attach the antenna cable to the device. Insert two Phillips screws to secure the vibrator to the rear case. Connect the antenna cable, the charge port, and the battery flex to the logic board. Make sure the connectors are properly aligned before snapping back into place and gently push on connectors until they connect.
Insert the battery bracket and insert the two Phillips screws to secure the battery bracket into place. If you have questions related to this repair, please contact Works for Assistance.